In 2023, the world will see the completion of huge mega projects that will change how engineering is done and how areas look. From tall buildings to amazing infrastructure, these big projects show how creative people can be on a large scale. With huge amounts of money and new technologies, these projects look like they will leave a lasting mark on the world. What are the long-term benefits and economic effects that these mega projects are expected to have on the places around them? Let's check it out. Starting with number 11, Madison Square Garden Sphere. The MSG Sphere, a cutting-edge theater equipped with state-of-the-art technology, will be the stage for a wide range of performances, from long-term stays and esports showdowns to business gatherings and unique spectacles. It stands head and shoulders above the rest, towering over 100 meters into the air and spanning about 160 meters in diameter, making it the world's largest sphere. Construction on the 17,500-seat auditorium hit a roadblock in April 2020, when the project's supply chain went haywire due to the COVID-19 epidemic, throwing a wrench into the works and pushing back the venue's grand opening until 2021. The opening is expected to take place in the latter half of 2023, when the rubber meets the road. Moving on at number 10 is Buffalo Bills Stadium. The NFL's Buffalo Bills have hit the nail on the head by breaking ground on their new $1.4 billion stadium in Orchard Park, New York. Construction is expected to be a piece of cake and completed in time for the 2026 season. The Populous team from Kansas City, Missouri will be calling the shots when it comes to design. The franchise claims that the stadium's open-air design and stacked seating arrangement would make the crowd noise go through the roof. Fans don't have to worry about being left out in the cold in the middle of an upstate New York winter because the building's vast radiant heating system has got them covered. On number 9 is Toon Razak Exchange, the vibrant hub of business and innovation. The Toon Razak Exchange, or TRX for short, is the 70-acre complex for international banking and business right in the heart of Kuala Lumpur, where the world of finance and commerce comes alive. Because it is situated on Jalan Tun Razak, the development was aptly named after Malaysia's second prime minister, Tun Abdul Razak Hussein. As the saying goes, honor thy roots and pay homage to those who paved the way. The economic transformation program of the Malaysian government puts all its eggs in the TRX basket as a key enabler. The next one on the list is the U.S. high-speed rail project in California. It is like a double-edged sword. It holds great promise but also comes with its fair share of challenges. A new high-speed rail route, the California High-Speed Rail Project, is being proposed to connect Los Angeles and San Francisco. It's like connecting the dots between two bustling cities with lightning speed. The total cost of the ongoing project is estimated to be a whopping $77 billion, an arm and a leg. The high-speed rail project has been a real roller coaster ride in California's history. There is no light at the end of the tunnel planned at this time. Coming to number 7, the UK's new Tam Tideway Tunnel is a game-changer. It's like a breath of fresh air in a stuffy room. London, England is getting a brand new sewer tunnel called the Tam Tideway Tunnel, which will be buried beneath the river itself. It's like a hidden gem beneath the flowing waters, ensuring a cleaner and fresher cityscape. Crossing the finish line, tying up loose ends and putting it to the test are expected to be wrapped up by 2025, with a price tag of 4.2 billion pounds. For at least the next century, the Tam Tideway Tunnel will keep the river safe come rain or shine. At number 6, we have the Zhongnan Center in Suzhou, China. Located in Suzhou, Jiangsu, China's Suzhou Industrial Park, the 499.2-meter-tall Suzhou Zhongnan Center is currently under construction, making it a towering project that is still a work in progress. The 729-meter height proposed in the original blueprints had to be kicked to the curb in 2019 due to China's ban on buildings reaching for the stars. The completed Suzhou Zhongnan Center will reach for the sky, standing tall at a staggering height of 499 meters and offering awe-inspiring views of Jinji Lake and the bustling cityscape beneath. The next one on the list is the Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dam. Ethiopia is currently in the process of building a dam on the Blue Nile, aiming to kill two birds with one stone by harnessing hydropower. When all is said and done, it will have a generating capacity of 6,000 megawatts, making it Africa's largest hydroelectric dam. The building should be completed this year come rain or shine. At number 4, we have Mumbai's new airport. A brand new airport called the Mumbai International Airport is in the pipeline to cater to the burgeoning population of Mumbai. As they say, if you build it, they will come. It is planned to kick off construction this year and wrap it up by 2030. At its full capacity, the airport will be a beehive of activity, handling 100 million passengers annually, making it one of the busiest in the world. Coming to number 3, we have London's Cross Line 2. London's second Cross Line rail is like a breath of fresh air in the bustling city. It's a game-changer, bringing a whole new dimension to London's transportation network. 
This project is the icing on the cake. The projected Crossrail 2 train line would connect Surrey in the south and Hertfordshire in the north of England, bridging the gap between the two like a bridge over troubled waters. The ball is already rolling on the project and we're set to hit the ground running this year. Crossrail 2 will be the icing on the cake and relieving the strain on London's already bursting at the seams public transit system. The completion date is set for 2030 come rain or shine. Once the railway is finished, the two-hour drive time between the cities will be cut to just 48 minutes in the blink of an eye. Moving on to number two, the new administrative headquarters, Cairo. Located in Cairo Governorate, the new administrative capital is a proposed new city that will serve as Egypt's capital, making it the apple of Egypt's eye. The country's economic potential will be given a shot in the arm and spread its wings, thanks to the new capital city, which is expected to be as big as Singapore. What's cooking in the heart of the city is Africa's tallest building, which is under construction. It is predicted to reach new heights, standing tall at 393 meters, leaving the Leonardo in South Africa in its shadow by a whopping 160 meters. The iconic tower is as strong as an ox, with a composite outer ring of columns and a center core of reinforced concrete. It will have a glass exterior and rest atop a raft of reinforced concrete as solid as the Rock of Gibraltar. The Belt and Road Initiative is greasing the wheels of this endeavor, which is being steered by the China State Construction Engineering Corporation. In the top spot at number one, we have the Toranamon Azabudai District, which is a whole new ball game. The Azabudai Hills, also known as the Toranamon Azabudai District, are a trio of Tokyo skyscrapers in the making, slowly but surely rising towards the sky like a phoenix from the ashes. When the project is complete, the tallest building in the city and all of Japan will be the icing on the cake of the complex. Standing tall at 325 meters and boasting 64 stories will be Tokyo's first super tall, making it a real game changer in the city's skyline. The combined height of the two neighboring structures will be as high as the sky. The skyscraper will have a hotel, cultural amenities, an international school and a variety of office spaces all under one roof. The Permasteeliza Group is putting on a show with the construction of the facade for the Mori JP Tower, while the Shimizu Corporation is reaching for the sky with the construction of the skyscraper itself. In order to join the large steel columns in the building's basement levels, Shimizu Corporation has deployed robo-welder welding robots, making sure they have all their ducks in a row. In addition, the project utilized 14 welding robots for usage on the upper stories, with these robots pulling their weight and adding fuel to the fire by performing around 15% of the overall welding. The contractor used five robo-carrier conveyor robots to effortlessly move items from the lifts to their rightful places, like a well-oiled machine. They moved almost 40,000 pallets of goods, all in one fell swoop. As these colossal mega-projects continue to rise and progress, they symbolize human ambition, innovation, and the burning desire to move mountains. With their completion, they will leave an enduring legacy, transforming skylines and economies and pushing the envelope of what we thought was possible. These projects are a shining example of the proof in the pudding, showcasing the boundless potential of teamwork and engineering expertise. Which mega project did you like the most and why? Do share your views in the comments below.